anywhere? Anywhere. <laughs> Having fun, Mr. Douglas? Oh, hello, Dawn. I, I was looking for you when this young lady asked me to help her with her bloom. Do you mind, Trixie? Muriel! We can talk here in the office. <laughs> Make yourself at home, Mr. Douglas. I guess you're wondering why I wrote that note. You know, Robbie and I have been going together for about a month now. He's such a nice boy. You have a very nice family. Nice house. Everything. I knew Robbie was different from the very first date. I just... Dawn, uh, why don't you tell me what's on your mind? I want you to keep Robbie away from here. Oh? He's a wonderful boy, and it'd be just fine if he'd stay that way. But it's too easy to lose your point of view in a place like this. First thing you know, the freaks start looking good to you, and then you've really lost your way. And I wouldn't want that to happen to Robbie. You know something, Don? Robbie's awfully smart about the girls he likes. He uh, always seems to pick the right ones. Thank you, Mr. Douglas. Thank you, Don. Good night. Happy. Hi, Don. Hi. How was the dinner show? Okay. Oh, good. I thought in between shows you'd like to go out and grab a sandwich. Robbie Douglas, meet Danny Daniels. Hello, kid. It was nice of you to hand Don a few laughs until I got back. Well, don't you get the message, kid? I'm back. I guess I better be going. See you around, kid. Yeah, see you around. Goodbye, Don. Bye, Robbie. I'll turn into drums and take up acting. You were very convincing. Oh, hi, Charlie. Well, what happened? How much did she want? She didn't want anything, Charlie. Mm -hmm. Where's Robbie? Oh, he tore over to the club between shows. And if you ask me, he'll be coming in with the milk bottles again. What are you doing here? I just finished telling your dad you'd be out all night. Yeah, well, the lady had another date. Oh. She had another date, huh? Miss O'Day seems to be the private property of some fellow with a pushed-in face who thought I was a kid, and I, I felt like one. Oh, well, what's the difference? Dad, I may be dumb about women, but I, I thought you could size them up. Nice girl, you said. Real sweet. From now on, I think I'll do my own picking. <laughs> His own picking? And who does he think came up with that gold-digging little package? You? Uh, he, uh, he could have done worse, Charlie. He could have done worse? Kicking around the stage with a bunch of balloons, leading him on and then giving him the cold shoulder for some... Hey, what about that note? And the talk she wanted? Oh, so you paid her off, huh? Was that it? Sure. So she throws Rob over. Oh, oh. Boy, she's a real honey. She is. Oh, oh. That's right, Charlie. She's a real honey. 